We live in a new age where people often interact with voice activated, artificially intelligent or voice AI devices, such as Amazon's Alexa and Apple Siri. We use these devices for simple tasks, such as setting timers, reminders, and getting weather updates. Sometimes we use tools like Alexa and Siri in interactive and socially meaningful ways, such as when we ask Siri to tell a joke. We're interested in what this might mean for human language and exploring the role voice AI devices play in our everyday speech interactions. Our research aim is to characterize how we talk to digital assistants. And as you can see, my Alexa is set up on a box of colored pencils and some paint. And then I cover um, the top box with some tissue, with some white tissue, so that you can't see the color of the box. <laughs> and Alexa is just standing on this little podium I've made for her. And the microphone just goes right next to it, which I plug into my laptop. What's number three? The word is kid. I misunderstood that. I heard kid or kid. Repeat the sentence one more time. The word is kid. Got it. What's number two? The word is den. I heard den. Repeat the sentence again. The word is den. All right. What we already did was use this R code to convert a VTT file. After that, we go through and listen and make sure that what's being said um, based on what's actually said in the video and a transcript that we have. We had to completely transition all of our experiments to be remote, so that way our participants and our experimenters would be safe. The experiments are really fun to do, and I enjoy being able to talk with people, especially now that we're online. <laughs> it's a great way to kind of interact with a bunch of other people.